here in the space shuttle flight control room. The object uh, highlighted in the left center of the screen, uh, backdrop by clouds over the Earth. Good morning, everybody. It is morning here in uh, Houston, and good afternoon uh, for everywhere else on the East Coast. Welcome to our mission status briefing today. This is April. We have all this vibration going on in the ship, and apparently something uh, shook loose. I say apparently uh, because it is uh, co-orbiting with the shuttle. Now, the question is, what is it? Is it something very benign? Um, it could be that piece of shim stock uh, that we showed uh, early in the flight was hanging on by a thread on the underbelly. Uh, is it uh, uh, some ice? Because we know that ice forms on uh, different parts of the shuttle orbiter when we do water dumps and, and other things. Um, is it something benign like that, which we have seen before? Or is it something uh, more critical that we should pay attention to? First, to follow up that, when do you have to make a decision on returning to the ISS if you're going to do that? Those assets that you have, and what have you looked at, and have you seen anything uh, obvious? One of the one of the first things that uh, the folks are doing is a payload base survey with the with the fixed cameras that are on the bulkhead of the orbiter, and uh, that was in progress when I left uh, Mission Control to come over here. I don't have any results. Obviously, if you saw, you know, say an EVA tool, I don't want to indict that, but but you know, in a hypothetical mode, if you saw an EVA tool that was there yesterday and is not there today, then you have a Eureka and you can go on from there. Um, so they are looking uh, at all the decals and blankets and, and uh, paraphernalia that's in the payload bay to make sure that uh, everything that was there yesterday is there today.